Hello and welcome to the Harmony Connect Remote Access Technical Training. Checkpoint Harmony Connect architecture contains three components. Controller and Gateway, both reside on the Checkpoint Cloud. The Connector, that resides in the Customer Data Center. Harmony Connect utilizes external identity providers to manage its users' credentials. Let's review how these components work together. The controller is the service option brains and manages all user authentication and authorization decisions. The gateway manages traffic flows between remote users and the internal data center applications through the connector based on the authorization received from the controller. The identity provider manages the user's authentication and access. When a user first authenticates to the controller, their credentials are verified by the selected identity provider. The controller matches the request with application's access rules and exposes the user to authorized applications on their user portal. When the end user requests access to a specific application, the gateway verifies the request with the controller and based on the authorization response, the traffic is allowed or dropped. The controller and gateway are in constant communication. Both reside on Checkpoint Cloud with high availability at different points of presence around the world, Europe, US, and Asia. From the end user standpoint, there is nothing to be installed. All they need to do is access through a browser to the Harmony user portal. This is the user's network. It can be spread seamlessly across different data centers. From a user's view, segmentation does not exist, but the user can't access any other services that are not available for them based on access control or permission. If the user tries to perform a non-approved request, since the controller and gateway are in constant communication, that request will be dropped at the gateway level. From a deployment standpoint, there is a one-time connector installation needed at the company data center. The connector itself is a component for tunneling purposes. It opens a secure mutual TLS 1.2 tunnel to the checkpoint cloud. There is no need to open any inbound ports whatsoever. Only outbound access from the connector to a set of IP addresses. From the application standpoint, the admin needs to verify the connector has internal address of the apps needed to be accessed. High availability may be set using N plus one active, active per site distributing the load between them by consistent hashing, meaning you can scale up and down the amount of connectors and the traffic will distribute equally between them and still maintain connection stickiness. Each connector bandwidth performance is 250 megabits per second and can scale up to five connectors per site. Using reverse tunneling, Harmony Connect provides access to data centers that may be fully closed to direct access from external sources. The connector is not an agent. There is no need to deploy it on any one of your servers. The connector is a dedicated Docker machine for each data center. Harmony Connect installations take five minutes to deploy. It is completely infrastructure agnostic. It can be deployed anywhere, any cloud or on-premise Docker host. The system is a cloud service, which has a built-in load balancer and can handle multiple connectors in the same data center. This capability allows for scaling up the number of connectors on the same site, thus supporting higher bandwidth. Some of the advantages of this architecture are, one, least privileged access model. Each user gets their own segment, and this is dynamically provisioned, so it can be spinned, stretched it, or shrunk according to the user access needs. There is no need for change at the network side, no VLANs nor security groups. Each user has their own segment. Two, separation of duties. Users are authenticated with a controller before ever being granted access to the network. The separation between the controller and the gateway creates massive security advantage. Remember that users are first authenticated before even being considered inside the network. Three, 
Harmony Connect uses a proprietary protocol and identity over proxies, which is a key differentiator when using other ZTNA solutions. The awareness of the protocol transitioned from the user device to the gateways to the set of those reverse proxies that are identity and protocol aware. This means that the solution can be clientless. Secondly, a termination point is created, which is Mutual TLS Client to Cloud and Mutual TLS Connector to Cloud, adding the gateway that is a termination point that allows full visibility to admins into who is inside the network. Compliance. Harmony Connect is Type 2 SOC compliant and planned to have FedRAMP very soon.